In this video, I'm going to be showing you my um, mobile hunting setup from the ground up. Okay, so this is all I have when I, uh, I arrive at the tree. So this is the tree that I'm going to be climbing. I got my bow here. Uh, I'm just going to put it on the ground for now. And I'll show you my backpack before I start climbing. So here, I'm running this setup right here where I have my platform. Um, in the back, I have my three Skeletor sticks with aiders on the bottom here. So this setup right here works really well for me as I don't need to take out my backpack. So this is what I have when I get to the tree. Okay, I have my backpack on. First thing I do when I put my bow down, I reach to my right pocket where I leave uh, a rope that I use to pull my uh, my butt my uh, bow up. So I'm gonna put it here on the side, and then I'm gonna attach it to my bow anywhere here. And here I got my bow attached um, to the rope. Okay. So now that I have my bow attached, I'm gonna reach to the back and take out my three sticks. Okay. Side, take out the three sticks. So I'm gonna start. This is the stick number three. I'm gonna leave it here. Stick number two. I'm gonna leave it right here. And I'm gonna take stick number one. And I'm gonna put it on the tree. Okay. So this is my first stick. I'm gonna go right here. Put it on the tree. I aim for the top uh, step to be at my forehead. I'm gonna come right here, and then go around the tree, and then here, I'm gonna go under, over, under, and then I make a loop, and I cinch it down, and I take the extra rope, and I just put it around, okay? Okay, a good idea to put my, my GoPro on my head, this way you can see here some climbing. Okay? I'm gonna take the GoPro, put it on, make sure it's directed here. This is good. Turn it on. Alright, so I got my first stick. I'm gonna open the steps and then I have this internal aider that I'm gonna put a link for um, that I made here and I'm gonna cinch it down. Okay? Alright, so now I got the first stick um, on the tree the other two sticks that i have here have these loops so this is a loop uh, at the top step and it's gonna go here right in this s clip on my side and i'm gonna do the same thing for the other one right here and it's gonna go on this s clip here on this side okay now i can leave my platform on my backpack or I can take it out reach for the straps take it out and then use this loop here that I have put on the top and stick it here on the back in this S clip okay so now I have everything that I need to start climbing I'm gonna take out my uh, lineman and I'm gonna place the ropeman here on the right, lock it, and then throw the lineman around the tree, and then here back on the other side of the saddle, okay? And then lock it in place. So as you can see, I got a bunch of linemen here. I'm gonna get it some more slack, and I'm leaning back here. So now I'm gonna take my foot, place it in the aider, and then use my weight to climb up the tree where I'm gonna put my second stick okay so I'm gonna reach out to the side I'm gonna lock my lineman a little bit more and reach out to the side and grab my second stick I grab my second stick here and I put it right here again top step at my forehead I'm 6'3 so I'm a little bit tall uh, if you're a little bit shorter you can put it a little bit down 
and then under over and then around and then here I make a knot and I take this extra rope and I put it around here okay this way it's not tingling then I take my aider pull it down pull out the steps cinch it okay let me just make sure my head GoPro is running yeah it's running and I'm gonna reach for the second step so I'm gonna give myself more slack here pull up the uh, lineman then put my foot put my weight into the saddle and then up I go okay go to the second one here and then here I get to the last stick that I put on the tree I'm gonna reach to the side grab the stick and then here I put it on the tree same thing top step at my forehead or a little bit below that then I go around okay then here under over under here around then my, I make a knot it's not necessary but I just like to add it and then I add take the extra put it around here okay all right then I open up the stick cinch it down take out the uh, aider and pull it down okay now I have my last stick here I'm gonna give myself some slack lean back into the saddle use my weight here and then up I go okay so once I get to the first um, step just click on it again good all right so once I get to the first step of the stick I'm ready to take out my platform I'm gonna take out my platform I have here this uh, gear tie at the top so I'm gonna tie it to my uh, lineman and here I'm gonna open the rope so I replaced the standard strap that came with the uh, tether platform with this USA Pro um, um, amp steel rope so I'm gonna take it around I'm gonna place it here and then I'm gonna take uh, this rope here pull it around through the uh, platform button and then I'm gonna make it a little bit tight I, I try to have the, my platform the same level as my last stick this way if I have to go around the tree so I'm gonna cinch it right here okay take the slack out of it pull and then I'm gonna take these here and put them through the platform and then pull one last time here and take this slack out okay I'm gonna push it down a little bit then I'm gonna cinch it down and there it goes okay it's not going anywhere I'm gonna take the rest just put it around and then here I take the rest okay so now I'm at the top uh, stick I'm ready to take out my um, my tether so I'm gonna reach to my left pocket and I'm gonna take out my tether and I'm gonna throw my tether around the tree okay it goes through this loop I'm gonna throw the loop around take the um, carabiner put it through the loop and then cinch it around the tree you see this tree here uh, has two big trunks I'm gonna choose this one here and then I'm gonna reach for my uh, bridge as you can see here I have a knot on my bridge I'm gonna undo the knot and then I'm gonna put my tether through the um, saddle bridge I'm gonna lock the carabiner and you can um, take this here 
and run it through the carabiner just as a safety measure this way if your rope man fails you have an extra um, knot keeping you attached to the tree okay now at this point I can either take out my uh, lineman or leave it I like to leave it so I'm just gonna go up with it here okay and then I'm gonna reach and pull my tether up to the appropriate height so I like to have the tether between my forehead and my nose and I lock it in place I'm ready to take my uh, lineman out so I'm gonna take the lineman here put it inside make sure everything is locked and then I'm gonna lean into my saddle okay so I'm locked right now I got my platform I have this stick here on my side if I need to go around the tree and shoot this way I can um, lean to the side here and shoot, shoot behind me and um, I'm ready to uh, take out my backpack for the first time so I'm gonna reach to the side and I have this um, his hauler so it's hang your stuff from tether and I'm gonna throw it around the trunk I like to leave it a little bit higher than my than my tether here around and I'm gonna lock it in place okay right there pull the strap on this side and I like to leave the extra end on my right hand side this way I can hang my backpack right here okay so I'm gonna shorten my tether take out my backpack and here on my backpack I have this uh, carabiner on the top I'm just gonna line it up here on one of the knots and I can take the backpack straps and put them around the tree okay just to secure it in place this way it's not swinging and there you go I have it you can use this for your knees if you don't have knee pads I mean they work just fine a lot of times I don't carry knee pads with me or I don't carry any pad I just use this one here and it works just fine okay all right so now I got my backpack here on my right. If I have any gear, any filming gear, I can reach out and grab my gear and take it out, put my cameras and everything. The last thing I do is pull up my, um, pull up my bow. So I have my bow on the ground. I'm gonna reach for the rope and then just pull it up here. Okay, there you go, still coming up. And I'm gonna take it. And I have this S-clip attached to the his hauler and I'm gonna put my bow right there on the side and it's gonna stay right there okay all right so now I'm ready to take out this rope and I'm just gonna leave it attached to my side uh, you can take it out and wrap it but I'm just gonna leave it there I can take this end out and I'm gonna attach it right here this way it's it's out of the way okay all right, so this is pretty much everything I do to, to get set up in my saddle. I have this recliner right here. It's a tether recliner. Uh, it doesn't come with the kit. I bought it separate. Um, you can put it here around you through your carabiner, your tether carabiner. And um, it helps you keep your, your back up. Okay, it gives you some some back support here I mean if if you're sitting for a long time but I, I usually don't use it so I just like to keep it for uh, long sits but I usually end up not using it so it just lives here on this in this live um, left pouch here okay all right guys there you have it uh, I got everything ready to hunt I can reach out for my bow if the deer are coming this side I can shoot this side if they're coming behind me I can shoot here if they're coming on this side I can go on this stick here and shoot right here around the tree if they're coming behind what I do is I throw my bow underneath my tether and I turn into my tether and there I can shoot anything that comes behind me here okay all right so now I'm gonna start just 
you know, doing everything in reverse and climbing down. So the first thing I do is I take the, the rope right here, okay, I attach it here, and then I'm gonna pull pull the um, the rope up and take your time. I mean, you don't need to rush anything. You can throw it around here. You can throw it around here and have it inside the rope, okay? Take your bow and then slowly um, slide it down, okay? Just take your time. You don't need to rush anything. Safety first. Make sure you're attached to the tree all the time. Keep your lineman attached and your tether um, all the time, okay? So I'm gonna put my bow on the ground. I got a couple of branches there. There you go. It's not ideal placements, but that's fine. I'm gonna be careful when I get down. Now I'm gonna um, take my backpack, open this strap here and put my backpack here on my back. I'm gonna strap it. Okay, take the other strap, put it on and take this off the tree and it goes into my left pouch okay it goes into this pouch right here and this is where i'm gonna keep it now the next step would be to throw my lineman around the tree to climb down so i'm gonna take the other end of the lineman throw it around the tree okay i'm gonna keep my tether attached my line lineman is secured here i'll keep my tether attached I'm gonna loosen it up a little bit pull it down here okay keep it attached to the tree until I'm on the first stick then I'm gonna drop down to the first stick here okay secure my lineman sit down and I'm gonna take out my platform take out the platform you do the same thing pull it up you push this here it loosens, you take it out, and then you loosen this one and take it out. Okay, I'm gonna wrap everything while I'm um, uh, climbing down. So I'm gonna take the platform, this gear side here, wrap it around this way, it doesn't play. And I'm gonna take this um, USA Pro and then throw it around the platform. I put a bungee cord here at the end of the USA Pro, it comes with one, so I just throw it around and then it stays like this. I'm gonna take this loop, run it through the um, S-clip on the back of my saddle and that's where it's gonna live, okay? So now I'm ready to take out my, my um, tether. I'm gonna make sure my lineman is attached and everything. And here I'm gonna start taking out my tether Take this one out, I'm gonna give it some slack. Take this one out, take the bridge. Sometimes it's gonna stick on your on your uh, uh, sticks. So take the bridge, just make one loop through and then it goes right here. And I'm gonna take out the tether and I'm gonna put it here in my um, left pouch, okay? I shouldn't have closed it, but I forgot. So now that I have the tether inside, okay, I'm gonna close it. Let me double check my uh, GoPro is still running, it's still running, that's good. Now I'm gonna loosen my lineman a little bit, drop down, keep my weight into my saddle, look for that uh, aider, and then climb down to the second step, okay? I get to the second step here and I'm gonna take out this stick. So I'm gonna pull the aiders here. I have these screws here on the back. So this, this is where they're gonna um, hook to. Close the steps and then take the stick out. Okay. I'm taking all my time here. You're gonna prepare your gear to pack out while you're climbing down. This way you're not wasting any time once you get to the bottom of the tree. And everything is organized. Here, over, lock it. And I'm gonna take this loop right here 
I'm gonna attach it to the S clip and that's where my stick is gonna live. Again, step down, step down another time, look for the aider, put my weight in the saddle and climb down here. Okay. Then take the second stick, same thing here, either first, steps, close the steps, and then take out this knot right here, and there you go. This one you can either put on your side, or you can just um, put down slowly, and it's close enough to the ground, okay? Now the last step, to get on this last stick and hit the ground okay you can keep your lineman all the way I like to open my lineman once I get to the last step it just helps me be more uh, agile here reach out for this bottom aider and then I'm right here okay I'm gonna take out this stick put it on the side here until I get the other ones. All right, pull the aider up. Okay. Close the steps. And then detach the stick from the tree. Okay. Put the rope around here. And this one will go on my second stick. A good advice is to um, number your stick so you can see here this is number one this is number two so I'm gonna put it right here okay on top of it okay close it and then take the the last stick and then do the same thing here just wrap up this um, amp steel rope around And it's the last stick that goes here. I'm gonna put the second one on top of it. Here, look for these holes. It can sometimes be a little bit tricky to put them together, but you'll get used to it. Now, I'm gonna take out my platform, place it right here. And this is when I first take my backpack out to pack the sticks and the platform. So I'm gonna take the backpack here start with the platform put the platform in here close the straps okay cinch them down okay and then take the sticks here I like to keep the um, this side away from me this way I don't get um, stung by the by the uh, sharp part of the sticks okay here and then right here and then I'm gonna take my backpack put it here on my back take my lineman put it in the uh, right pouch where it lives till the next hunt here it goes down Okay, close the pouch. Now I'm ready to uh, wrap the um, the bow rope. So I like to take this one here, put it between my ring finger and my middle finger. And then I'm gonna go around the thumb, through the pinky, around the thumb, through the pinky. And then I'm gonna do it over and over. This way when your uh, rope is pulling down, it pulls down super nice okay and you don't need fancy um, um, ropes to to pull up your gun or your um, or your bow okay this is just a regular 
um, rope that I got from from Walmart. So once I have about I don't know a foot left here, or maybe yeah 12 inches, I'm gonna go around here and then through here, and there you go. I got my rope ready, and it goes right here in the right pouch the last thing that i put in the right pouch and then i lock my backpack ready to walk out of the woods take my bow right here and there you have it guys uh that was my climbing setup from the bottom up and climbing down with um with my saddle okay i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel we're almost at 500 subscribers now uh, in less than a year. So I really appreciate you guys uh, subscribing and tuning up uh, and I'll see you next time.